This is our ugly prepper coming to you today from the yard. Let me uh, get you here. Going to work on uh, fire building skills today. Let me see if I can't find a place. I have to film all my stuff on a tablet because my old Samsung cell phone, I can take a three minute video on it and it takes five hours to upload it. But this tablet is quite a bit faster. So let me see if I can't idea of what's going on. Oh, mercy. Hope everyone's having a blessed day. I'm going to sit right here. Make myself comfortable. I know the lighting is not good here. I'm trying to uh, clear out a little spot here so I don't pitch the entire state of Alabama on fire. That would be bad. Our greatest fire starting stuff here is uh, pine straw. And pine straw is very good. And if that won't take a spark, I do have some charcoal. We'll have to see just how it goes. All right. This is the end of the rod that I want to use here. Let's see if we can do it. I got a little splinter in my finger, which makes it tough. Looks like we're going to have to go to the old char cloth. Move, son. In my video. Char cloth is a prepper's best friend. <laughs> that sucker will take a spark like nobody's business. It will get your hand a little dirty though. If we can't get a, it's very windy today too. That's not going to make it any easier. Well, unless I get a good ember going. Let's see. Come on now. Never as easy as it looks. Never as easy as it looks. There we go. We got something going there. Come on, baby. Char cloth is doing its thing. And I don't know if you can see that, but we have fire. And I'm fixing to put that out so I don't catch the whole world on fire here. But that's why you have char cloth and you have different options. Option one may not always work. So it's good to always have different options. This uh, ferro rod is not always going to work. That's why you have big lighters or stormproof matches. So anyway, wanted to do a short video today about uh, fire starting. Kind of display my little skill set I'm working on here. Hope everyone has a blessed day. This is the ugly prepper and the dogs out here in the yard. Have a good one.